Hello, everyone. It's time for more Majora's Mask. Just completed Stone Tower, but I think it. But it is time to do a little bit of cleanup. I didn't get all the stray fairies, and I'm already close to getting all the um, pieces of heart. So uh, why not? <laughs> Let's just go ahead and do that. Let's go ahead and do that and get that out of the way. So, let's begin. Okay, so I have three whole heart heart containers left to get, so. Well, let's see here. If that's after that, there's four more. And the last four are in the moon. So let's get started. Ye who hold the sacred sword. Ye have returned to the appointed spot. If you wish to interrupt your bit, we get it. Okay. Time to enter into Stone Tower one last time. Hi, Ben. Too many fairies. at um, dawn of the final day. 
flip the temple upside down again, but I'll still try and get this last one that's here. Treasure chest down here. Number fourteen. Now I go back, flip the castle again. Then get that treasure chest up there, and then get that treasure chest up there. And then I'm done with Stone Tower. And then I can get the final Stray Fairy item.
And done. Now to go off to... Gotta Canyon. Hey, Kit. Hello. You okay? Yep. Uh, I got a little ambitious regarding my uh, my computer, so I'm using my laptop. You ever do that thing where you're like, I'm going to do one thing on my computer. Oh, well, since I'm going to do that thing, I should probably do this thing. Which means I should do this thing at the same time. Which means I should definitely have this and this in order. <sighs> And now, hey, uh, Kit. Yo. You're gonna love this, um, fairy upgrade. I do like the Madonna upgrades, yes. Would you like the- would you like the voice- would you like to voice them? Oh, compassionate young one, I am the great fairy of kindness. Thank you for returning my, bro my sh broken and shattered body to normal. As thanks, I grant you the fairy sword. It will definitely not get you into trouble in high school. Whoa. You got the great fairy sword. <laughs> so what do you think? I like it. It's shiny. Yeah, let me look. <clears throat> With black oh, roses yeah. etched into it, the Ooh. great fairy's sword is the most powerful of all blades. Never actually heard of this, but I haven't gone that far. In the Come game, see so. me whenever you are overcome by weariness. Yeah, the only other game that the great fairy sword appears in is um, Soul Calibur 2. I don't Take know if out. the Great Fairy Sword makes an appearance in Hyrule Warriors. Also, her face is really creepy. <laughs> you just your now face. noticed that? Y your face is really creepy. No, I've noticed. <laughs> also, I'm working on an assignment right now, so I'm going to be a little scatterbrained. That's okay. Here it is. I... Which you don't know about or anything about, right, Kit? Right, Kit? I... That's that's it's not like that would literally be the label I'd put on this entire day or anything. Speaking of which, I did just respond to you, so uh, design. Yeah. No, you're good. Sorry. I'm... This is the great fairy sword. Despite being a clown and good with balls, I'm just not much of a juggler. <laughs> okay. I'm answering a bunch of questions about the Fibonacci sequence. <laughs> oh, I love the macaroni sequence. <laughs> Basically, the next place I need to go to is. Yeah, next place I need to go to is Clock Town. What am I doing? What was I doing? What was I doing? I can see why. Linux isn't as popular an operating system when you have to partition it and install it on yourself because it never comes pre-installed on anything. Um. You can see why people are a little hesitant to do it themselves when it's a tad more work.
The funny thing is, literally everyone I know in my immediate circle has been borked by Windows updates recently. Yep. Mm -hmm. uh, my sister had a Microsoft Edge update, and now it won't retain some cookies. She has to keep logging into some sites oh, every time she closes the browser. That sounds fun. That sounds fun. We love fun things, don't we? I haven't been enrolling, so let's do it. Uh, naturally, my sister makes only the happiest of fun noises. All the four-letter fun noises. <laughs> oh, shoot. Where was I? Here we have Kit being scatterbrained. Real evidence. <laughs> uh, I am boomeranging a little bit, because it turns out the other day the reason Don't I was worry, so I'm just, I'm just being teased. I'm just... I'm not being serious. No, you're good. You're good. I'm just saying, you guys know my baseline, so... Whew. When I'm saying I'm having a day, you better... Take that to heart. I'm way better at this on the uh, 3DS. Yeah, the, the problem with um, the shooting the arrows on it in this um, game in comparison to playing this on the actual N64 is because there is a little bit of a there is a little bit of a um, delay between controller and it controller and input because the, the fact this game is on an emulation instead of the actual console yeah and on um, the common emulation issue yeah which is dumb because nintendo should have access to like all the means necessary to actually make it the best type of emulation because they own the properties to it oh you would think but in the mario 3d all-stars the people pulled it apart, and they found that the that their version of Mario Sunshine is basically using Dolphin. So they didn't even bother to like wrap it in their own. I mean, they made the game higher res, but like they didn't even bother uh, doing a whole lot of uh, their own custom emulation. Heart. Uh, give me beer. Okay. Yeah, I'm happy that the game gives you two minutes and 24 seconds for you to get out of deep water. I'm trying to remember. Fingers, I see you in chat. Come on. No!
Okay. I understand. You do what you gotta do, fingers. I knew that I had a reason to have the Scarecrow song. Everybody, because of all the times I forgot to do it while I was, um, all the times I forgot to do it, my decision, my mistake, is now officially coming to bite me in the rear. Because guess what I get to do again? I have to fight goat again. Yay! Because I need because I need the spring here again. I don't mind using Dawn of the... I don't mind using, um... Dawn of the... I don't mind using the final day to collect the last of the, uh... Since I'm here doing them... Since I have the time anyway. Mm-hmm. Come on. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> hey, hey, goat. Huh? Ready to beat you? Ready for me to beat you again? Probably getting tired of that, isn't he? Um, yeah, but I have no choice because I completely forgot to get um because I looked up where the rest of the pieces of heart are. And I might as well do that. And I might as well take the opportunity to do that since I have nothing else to do during the during this last day. Uh, fingers is so too tired to join voice chat, so you probably saw that. Um, yeah, he said that he needs um, peace and quiet right now, which I don't blame him. 
<laughs> we all gotta. Yeah, I'm still, I'm still recovering a little bit from the migraine I had this morning. Hmm. You get those too, huh? Um, yeah, I have. I have effectively just like high blood pressure. I have blood pressure headaches. I don't know why I get them because uh, I don't have like. Uh, my sister, bad. my sister yeah. does it. My sister gets. Yeah. I've never had a migraine, but she gets them. And uh, in her case, it's often stress. Yeah. But I guess everybody's different. That might be what it is. They did not just drop a link on my on my thing from an account called Woke Karen. Oh dear. I was sure I was under that. No. Okay, never mind. That's fine. It's cute. I hate those freaking electrical bolts. You have no way to dodge them while you're in there. Sometimes they look like speedrun strats, and then I'm like, I think the strat is actually harder than actually doing the, the rest of the, doing it the, doing it the regular way. Oof, something those edges. Ow. Hey, did you know when you did you know when you microwave sticky rice for like two minutes it actually gets very hot? Uh a while to heat it. <laughs> they should have warned me that it gets hot when you heat it. Why? What no? Who would have guessed that? I know, right? Look, I'm not saying it's me that made the entire pharmaceutical industry put. Do not take this if you're allergic to it on the bottle. <laughs> oh, also, uh, uh, are you available to respond to them? Yeah. Uh, I am. Are you okay? Oh yeah, no, I, I'm. I'm just trying to do too much. I may just, I may need to throw in the towel on a couple of things. I. Do you, I get this thing where it's like sometimes some days where I'm like not feeling so hot, I don't get a lot done, and that really annoys me. So then I try to make it up on other times, but like when you do too much. Though. Yeah, yeah, you gotta you gotta have limits too. I have. Um, there's a phrase um, that I heard, and I don't normally quote. Uh, uh, I don't normally quote Mormon sources, but I thought this was nice, which was, um, uh, uh spare, spare a sliver of, spare a sliver of the kindness you show others for yourself. Hmm. Don't be mad at yourself for things you can't control. Glad they don't have me doing like those public speaking workbooks or whatever. That, that, would, that wouldn't end well. <laughs> mm. 
Now, where were we? Where were we? Where were we, kids? Uh, when we were looking, we were talking about our inspirational quotes last week. Uh, Oodle Ollie, sir. Ah, that's right, Robin Hood. Anyway, I tell you guys about. Uh, let me tell you guys about the first time I saw that scene where Maid Marian looks right at the camera. Get back to springtime on the mountain. Okay, I apologize that my brain's all over the place today, but that frog made me think of something I haven't thought of in a long time that I need to like I need to write down a memoir of like silly stuff that makes me happy um the first time I played XCOM you ever played XCOM? yeah oh well which know. versions? uh the Xbox 360 one is the one I I cut my teeth on I, I didn't play the original until after that one actually oh okay um and in that one you get your own soldiers and you like name them and stuff right? well you can do the same here the original PC one too. Yeah. But I do get it. And so, so you get, you get your guys, and you name them, and even get kind of attached to them. And so I'm there with my friend, and we have to name these guys. And I'm like, oh wait, it shows their nationalities as well. I'm like, okay, what should I name them? I'm not good at giving names. And the guy goes, just pick like the most like culturally insensitive thing you can think of. And so for my very first playthrough, my best soldier by far. I adored this guy. It was a Frenchman named Gaston Lefrog. Oh dear. And Gaston was my best soldier. He, he kicked ass. And then he got, and then some spider limb thing just cut him in half in one go, one mission. Oh, um. Ooh. Rest in peace. I'm trying to remember the name of the aliens. I'm bad at that. Yes, he served. He served the. Uh, he fought for uh, uh, Queen and Crate. I would. I went to his funeral and I said, "He was my guest. He did. He did. In, he did indeed be my guest." Now, should put him up on my my memorial there is of uh oops, sorry it's in the Kana canyon you put up a memorial of my most beloved game characters lost in action but then I'd run out of room if I played hell divers <laughs> oh yeah, um, I remember seeing a, I remember seeing a stream of, a long time ago, um, Noah Antweiler, the Spoonie one, he was doing a, um, let's play of the original XCOM, and, uh, mm -hmm. yeah, of course, all of his guys were getting off of the ship, and, uh, guess what immediately happened? Where's that? The worst possible thing you can imagine. Oh no. Enemy lobbed a grenade in there. Oh no. Oof. All but one survived. Wait, all but one died. I do think it'd be kind of interesting though to have like an album of like your zaniest gaming moments. I've had a few good ones. Well, isn't that what the clip thing for uh, clip um, thing for uh, Twitch is for? Well, most of mine were before Twitch was a thing. <laughs> I have oh. some Halo. Halo. I had the wildest Halo one, okay? People don't even believe this happened, and I swear on everything that. Well, I don't hold anything sacred, but you get the idea. Mm -hmm. um, I swear that on everything that is good and some that are not. There you go. Um, 
when we were playing on the Sidewinder level, really long level, you know, a lot of distance, my buddy had the sniper rifle and I had the rocket launcher. This was kind of a perennial matchup. Um, he was a good sniper. I was a good rocketer. I don't know. Um, and uh, we fired at the same time and they collided in midair. He was shooting at me, I was shooting at him, and the rocket blew up, like, in the middle of the entire level. I can't even imagine the precision that would take. Like, we couldn't have done that if we tried. During the time I lobbed a plasma grenade, completely blind, over the wall, and just heard my friend, What the poo? As it just currently landed on his forehead. Oh dear. Boo boo, see do. I love me some Halo back in the day. Everything okay, Zero? I'm fine. I just need to um, keep it. I'm just um, making sure that I. Trying to figure out which ones I'm missing. Oh no, you did. Because I only have like one left. No worries. I figured it wasn't a technical glitch, it's not one of my streams or anything. Good. Good. My computer's hit 5% in the last hour. Pick ass. Where? The secret shrine. Ooh. The secret. Is it a shrine too? Or is it a shrine? Or is it a shrine to secrets? Just be aware, as long as it is, as long as we all remember to make the joke of the shrine of the silver monkey. Dude, he yeah, he really hammed up that inflection. He just he just went full into that, didn't he? Yeah. I freaking ah, I love that show. That was such a good show. If they ever brought back any of the old Nickelodeon shows, that would be one I would seriously put at the top of the list. I'm trying to remember who voiced the Poe Collector last time. Uh, it's either me or Fingers. Well, I'm, well, Fingers is taking a break, so I guess it's you. Well, Fingers is a ghost. Perfect to do it, then. <laughs> <laughs> it seems somehow that you've managed to send the Ikana's wandering spirits into peace. But outside of Ikana, there are still swarms of... Wandering spirits with lingering regrets. The ones in this room want to meet you again and have been waiting here for quite a while. Go see them if you feel like it. I'm sure they'll welcome you. Maybe boss rush. Hey, my soundboard. Oh, good. I was scared. For a minute, I was afraid that no longer would we would we know the would we know the future. No longer would it. It was foretold by Gyromancy. 
<laughs> just glitched out for a minute. <laughs> it scared me. I thought we were to be without gyromancy. Love rupee. Not that I need it, because I already have 500 rupees. I love that they added like sick flips in this. Yeah, it's like you know, it's like Young Link played Tomb Raider, and he's like, I gotta get serious. Happily, you get to see Wizard one last time. Good, I love this guy. Dude, if I played Warhammer Fantasy, I would very much convert an orc weird boy to look like him. Or like an orc shaman. I forgot that's what they're called in fantasy. Dude, that them. sword is bigger than he is. It's like a space marine sword. That's gigantic. I love it. Oh my god. I need to make a space marine with a fairy sword. <laughs> yeah, I can, I can hear the gears turning in Kit's head right now. <laughs> Now, CeeLo, I'm afraid I've been thinking. A dangerous pastime? I know. Brother Orfeo, what is this relic weapon you wield? Uh, it is pretty, Brother Captain. It is very sparkly. Brother Orfeo is just pretending to do magical roll transformations with his new sword in his, uh, in the ready room. Man, Gemini Man's 3D level is wild. Uh, do you want me to play the Yellow Devil music and go get Bully? <laughs> yeah, Bully hasn't been here in a while. I only got Bully on one of my streams ever. And I went to all the trouble to make him Raphael the Raven. Aiden said his job has very bizarre hours. Thank <laughs> you. 
my freaking spin attacks hit him. I didn't mean to do that, but whatever. No, I mean, I totally meant to do that. Yeah. You just... Yeah, you just... There you go! There you go. I'm so proud of you. you now you... That's how you do it. Pretend that you knew you were doing all along. <laughs> yeah. You just sort of Boba Fetted your... Boba Fetted the guy. Googly eye monster. Googly eye monster, where? Well, that time it actually hurt. That time the explosion actually hurts you. You see, he, you really are an amazing person, Silo. It seems you've somehow managed to heal their souls with your big ass sword. Maybe I shall vanish soon myself. Well then. <laughs> He's gone to a better place. He's gone to Wendy's on free frosty day. <laughs> I have one more piece of heart that I'm missing. And I'm trying to remember now where it is. Got the one I kind of... I already got the spirit house. I already did the Don Jero quest, the Wonder of the Water, I talked to the Town Lookout. Went to the other side of the river, talked to the old woman twice. Got the one in Great Bay Coast. Got the one in Zora Hall. Got the one in Pinnacle Rock. Zora Cape. Great Bay Coast, and kind of graveyard. Got that one. That one. Got that one. Got that one. Got that one. Got gossip stones. Kitchen quiz. Got that one, got that one. Did you get the one where you tell the happy mask owner that he's a creepy mofo and he realizes it and like decides to reevaluate his life's choices and gives you a heart piece for, for being honest with him? <laughs> oh, hmm. boy, that were true. Yeah, I don't know if that's going to work with him, honestly. Yeah. I'm missing one. <laughs> What? I thought that's how you usually did it with psychopaths, you know, or in weirdos. You know, you're like, you know, you're, you're a freaky deaky, my friend. Yeah. Definitely. <laughs> Oops, my I, uh, I am greatest diplomat in history of world. <laughs> this homework assignment is like one of those homework assignments where each question isn't that hard, but it's 
a lot of them. <laughs> oh boy. I almost would prefer math when it's math. I actually kind of preferred ones where it was just more concise, frankly. Mm. If they were longer. Okay, honestly, I think I'm... Yeah, because there's one left, unless there's five on the moon. YouTube's new altered content policy? What? Oh! I was just casually clicking an, an upload thing. Since uh, my computer was chugging, I was just sending an archive video. And uh, they added a thing to YouTube where uh, you have to say whether your content does any of the following. Makes a real person appear to say or do something you didn't do alters footage of a real event or place, or generates a realistic, realistic looking scene that didn't actually occur. Mm -hmm. oh, uh, that's um, good for AI. For AI, definitely probably. For AI, yeah. I, that's probably for the best. Although, expecting people to be honest is kind of a... a reach, but... Mm -hmm. Yeah. That's okay, the entire site's run by bots, basically, so... I mean, no, there's people who work hard on it, but like, a, like moderation is all, seems like it's almost entirely automated. It's a bit that long. Thank goodness me. Okay, I'm going to uh, check one last... I was gonna say, I only got the bottle there, I didn't know it was possible to get a heart piece too, so... We're off to, uh... Great Bay Coast. Zora. By the way, there is a thing I did notice that um, in the at the very end of the game, you actually have to hand over your masks. If you make the unfortunate choice of hang handing over your transformation mask, you can easily softlock yourself. I've heard this game has like more softlocks than like any Zelda. Need hookshot. How goes it, my friend? Uh, my my ability heard now. Hi, hello. There you go. Yeah, you're popping just. Mm. I can hear you now. Yeah. All right. Um, doesn't seem like there's gonna be a game tonight because uh, Drakkar is busy with things. So. Well, I'm sorry I'm to hear here that. For the time mm -hmm. being, unless things change. Look, look at me, look at me. I am the Power Rangers now. And I'm gonna be really honest with you, the only reason I'm like an hour late to this is because I was reorganizing all my Gotchard card binders. I both, both have of them gotten are. lost in that I sort of two. thing. Yeah, I, I reorganized them all. Because, guess what, Have having new ones means you gotta, gotta organize shit. Yeah. I don't relate to that at all. It was as though a million Warhammer figurines cried out in terror, 
and was suddenly silenced. <laughs> under a giant, under a giant foot, which screamed in agony. Thank <laughs> God it's revenge, though. <laughs> Oi. Oh, my back hurts real bad. Uh. Um. Do you think uh, it has anything to do with like the way you sleep, or do you think it's more to do with the like day job? I think it's the job. Hey, Beaver. I need to talk to you again. You mean, so I used to sleep on my side, so I don't know that that has that can do things, but you can depending on how you do it. I guess. Hey, um, now get now guess what? Now everyone gets to see freaking this game's reinterpretation and how to make a certain terrible N64 game better. Oh boy! You again? You can't fool me with your green gloves. You want an empty bottle, don't you? You never learn your lesson. I'll give you one, but I you can swim through all the rings in the river in under two minutes. So you want to try? Sure. I love that you can fight like giant monsters and like bizarre entities, but like you're just too decent a person to just like punch a beaver in the face and steal his ship. And fine, I'll play your game. Solve my maze, Superman. <laughs> I do love the swimming animations in this. They are really cool. I don't know what to do with these things. Eat them. These no. Sorry, I had to channel Adrian for a minute. Well, I had to channel what what it caused me to channel Boxer. I guess if the one to channel Boxer should have made it more deadpan. Yeah, true. You know, I actually, I actually don't don't have very many of the Commander Gotchard toys. I have like a ton of the cards, but not very many of the toys, which they have not. Don't care. <laughs> I don't blame you. It's been an odd series. It's like I literally just have the Doctor Driver, the X Scott Chalibur, the Chemier, the the a whole turtle, the whole turtle Chemierizer. And the Gotchan collection panel. That's it. That's all I've got in terms of actual toys. I have nothing else. I don't want anything else. Well, sometimes that's for the best. It's kind of nice to know what you don't want to collect, so you don't have to worry about what you do. I mean, it means I'm missing like a ton of cards, but I don't care. <laughs> it's because all those cards come with the toys. I am, I am missing all those. I don't have those. Yeah, they'll probably hit the aftermarket at some point. They have already. I'm just neurotic about that shit. I like things to stay together. That went together. Yeah, that can be a collector thing. I don't like separating things. If I can help it. Well, that's good. See, so I've just kind of decided I'm, ne I'm never going to own all those cards unless I get, the unless I get those toys. Which, I don't know if that'll happen. <laughs> There have been some limited edition, like, big collector Warhammer things where I've been, like, really tempted, but I'm like, I gotta learn to just 
be like, eh, you don't get everything. I mean, I'm kind of considering, like, Gotchard's further upgrades, but at the same time I'm like, do I really care enough, though? I mean, I have the first upgrade, but do I really need the other ones? Do I really need those? Not really. Get another one. Let it be over. I will say the uh, the 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 new booster booster set that that came out that I just you know got in today. Um, its card distribution is really unfair. <laughs> it has yeah. pull rates are very unfair. Not not nice compared to the previous two. Uh, I should have given you some of my. My amazing booster card luck. Yeah, you should have. Seriously, to this day, I have friends who will be like, "Hey, can you go buy me?" Well, a maybe booster? I should have have you buy me another box, and then your luck transfers to it. Hey, that's a great. Wait a minute, I know what you're trying to do. <laughs> uh, got you. Almost got you. Ain't I a stinker? I'm trying to figure out, um... I don't Thank think you. I could ever underestimate how crap the Excatalibur is. Little pokey stick. This crap. I'm, I'm literally holding it in my hands, and this thing is just crap. It's crap. This thing is crap. I don't know if you want to admit to holding crap on on Twitch. It's crap. <laughs> it's crap. What were they thinking? They're thinking money. Yaka. Okay. It says here that you can. It says here that you can. Oh, it says here, um. I used to be re don't get either a bottle or rubies. Challenge them again for an even harder race. But how do I challenge them again? Where are they? I don't know. Is it, is it time locked to a certain day? Oh, nope, there they are. But I thought they'd be underwater again. What are you doing out here? He's back, little brother. Yeah, you back, big brother. But we don't have any more empty bottles. Do we, little brother? No, we don't have any, big brother. If you say you want to, still want to race, that, that's fine. What will you do? I'll race you. First, you have to start with my little brother. This time, the limit is a minute 50 seconds. Don't fall behind. I, I don't know how they managed it. What the X... Is somehow simultaneously tiny and dinky and bulky and unwieldy. That's a weird combo. Both at the same time. I don't know how they managed it. They were making it to specifically piss off Gimlet. <laughs> I, I, I guess. <laughs> Not even fun. Just a big, a, a big block. Yeah, big, big sword. It's just a tiny, dinky sword that you fold up into a block and plonk on the gotcha driver. For really, for really boring, really boring additional shit. Did I ever tell you about the knockoff Buster Sword I bought when I was a teenager? Yes. Yeah, that was like falling apart, and it was like it was it was ridiculously heavy, like because it had like actual metal, and I didn't realize that the hilt, even though the outside was metal. The inside had like, uh, like wood and cardboard, like corrugated, and the glue started failing. Oh my god, that's really bad. And the first time I tried to pose with it, I fell over with it. Ah. It's a bad knockoff. I still have, I still have, I think I still have the, 
I think I still have the hilt for sentimental reasons, like the the base of it, because it was still it was kind of funny. You did it again, little brother. You did it again, big brother. That's shameful, little brother. Not you must play a lot of Superman 64, big brother. What will you do, <laughs> race? Time limit is the same as it was for my little brother. One minute fifty, but there are twenty-five rings this time. Don't fall behind. I don't know, Kit. Should I should I get the Gotcha Igniter? Should should I should I get Ten Liner and Crosshopper? Uh, I would I I would err on the side. I I tend to I know it's a trite thing, but there's this I can't remember what it's called. But there's a there's a, the thing they talk about for like keeping a home a joyous home, which is if an item doesn't bring you immense joy, don't keep it near you. And I tend to do that with things like collecting. If it's not something that I'm going to like look upon on my shelf with like satisfaction, then I generally say no. If it's something I will look at and it'll make me smile, then I consider it. Sorry to bother you. This you about this again? Oh, I am. I am mid thingy, but I am distractible, aren't I? Uh, my bad. Oh, excuse me. Oh, you're good. I'm. I'm extra distractible today. Like I, I'm distractible at the best of times, but today's a. Come on. Uh, oh no. But today's a doozy. Kit, it's like. Uh, the thing is, it's like I, I genuinely don't know what I want to do with the gotcha stuff at this point. If I make a suggestion, and I, one of them make a suggestion. Sure. Like if it reaches a point where um. Reaches a point where you don't like having it in your house, then, and it's reaching the point, and I don't know um how you how big you are into it, but I'm thinking Not it really might reach a point I... where you just sell the stuff. I mean, it I'm would help kind of considering. Actually... Part of me is saying because because Arcadius freaking adores Gotchard, trying to sell it all to him. Yeah, that might be a good idea. It's not a bad idea. <laughs> oh no, the One Ring. Left. The Batman. one ring that screwed me over. One ring to screw them all over. One um, ring to screw them all. <laughs> no, no. Uh, but I think before I do that, I'm gonna wait until the, all the rest of the shit I have pre-ordered shows up. That's fair. I do think. I do think. I do think if there are any pre-orders that are cancelable, if that's your inclination, that's something you could consider. But I know some of those sites are weird about that. Yeah. No. I. At this point, uh, I'd, I'd rather, if I'm ever going to sell it, I'd sell a more complete collection. Oh, wait. you know, that's fair. There's merit to that. Yeah. Um, but yeah, I think, I think, because I know you already have, like, space issues anyway. If it's making you more stressed or annoyed or inconvenienced, then, yeah, it's probably better to at least make a, make a little also, bit of Gosh, a... Gosh, is a bad know. show with bad toys. I... Am finding it a very bad show as well. I'm afraid, yes. Yeah. Well, zero, yeah, I'm zero. glad I never got. I, I, I'm glad that went back when Spanner's toys were gonna come out. I canceled all those. So Spanner ended up being such a lame, boring character. I actually feel kind of bad that in like the most tragic episode with him, we would keep I couldn't stop cracking jokes about it because I, I, I know I, it's, such a it's so poorly written. I really can't. I feel bad on some level. Arca Ar Arcadius did, did say we were bad people for, for laughing at that episode. I mean, very fair. Even though it's like Spanner's... It, 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 how do yes. I put this? It's like Spanner's just so boring. He's a formidable opponent, little brother. You're just, you're all just talk, eh, big brother? If we give that to him, I wonder if he'll leave us alone, little brother. Yeah, I want to quit, big brother. Got a piece of heart. Please, let it be over. Yeah, let the series, let the Gotchard series be over. Jesus. It won't be over until August. Let's get that old yeller moment. Hey there, Travis. What you doing with that gun? 
Yeah, no, Goshard, Goshard will not be over until August. Ah, oh, shoot. Oh, you okay, Kit? Kit, do you even want to catch up on Goshard at this point? You just want to give up on it. I don't know. I, I, I enjoy... I enjoy watching stuff with you in any context, and there are, like... There are some humorous elements to how bad it is, but I'm... True. I'm I'm open to however you I'm open if you wanna mm. bail on that, I'm open to that. I'm thinking about it. I mean I don't know. There's shit there's important shit that's happened that we haven't seen, I know that. Um I kinda wanna see see Iron Gotchard and Platinum Gotchard in action. We still got a ways. Still got to catch. Got a long way to catch up. Wait, there are two. There are two more Godchard forms now. It, yeah, Iron Godchard and Platinum Godchard. Unfortunately, I unfortunately stopped watching right before the vampire episodes. Uh, we didn't even get that far. I think we had just. When did we stop? Like, I, I know we. Saw, I know we saw Fire Godchard's introduction. Yeah. Last, last, last one we, we, we saw was was the tragic episode with Banner, with you know, bringing Span the guy bringing Spanner's parents back to life for a short bit just to torture him. That was the last episode me and Kit saw. Yeah, I saw the I saw the um, ending. I saw the ending to that arc. I'm using air quotes here. Yeah, we have not. We don't know how that arc ends. Aside from Spanner is a common writer now, I guess that's all. That's all we know about yeah. the, how that but, goes. Um, it pretty much it pretty much goes like that. Yeah. Yeah. I don't know if you care about spoilers at this point. Uh, I I'll probably watch it at some point. Okay, so I have I have all the bottles. No, no, like part of me feels like I should. Just for posterity's sake. Yeah. Is even the right word? Yeah. I'm still I'm still reading freaking I'm still reading manga chapters of freaking um, My Hero Academia that's just out of out of obligation at this point for me. Mm, Alright. Yeah, my my hero definitely dropped off hard body wise. For my hero academia. Yeah. Yeah, they've reached yeah, we're reaching the. Uh, we're effectively reaching the conclusion for My Hero Academia because because Deku is now inside freaking is now inside Shigaraki's head. I love it. I love hearing this stuff out of context because like that must be how you, it sounds when I say like anything about Warhammer. It must be like exact same experience. Yeah, pretty much. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, by the way, did you? Oh, um, to those without context, uh, Luffy is now Bugs Bunny. That's the way I'm gonna, it. I'm gonna, I'm gonna back up for a second here, um, and, and make sure that I actually caught that correctly, that my, that my ears did in fact hear those words, that my brain did in fact interpret it that way. <laughs> Unfortunately, it's unfortunately my statement is not. Um, it is a TF, but not that, but not furry TF. <laughs> That's all, folks. But um, yeah. Um, how far have you have you gotten uh, any farther in? Um, have you gotten any farther in um, One Piece? By the way, I admit I stalled on that. I've been. Uh... I but I I do have access. I need to I need to get back on that because I actually have access to a lot of the early manga. Actually, I could watch the show. That might be easier because I could do that when I'm working and stuff. But I don't know how. Um, there's if you're depends on which depends on the um show you want to watch is um because if you watch Funimation if you watch the Funimation stuff there is filler. Mm. Like, um, and they did change some things. Like, here's a big example. The, the, the anime does 
uh, it changes the pacing a little bit. Some scenes are re some scenes are re some events are rearranged. Um, like there, like there, like there's like there's a bit of a, like there's a, an event early on that I think in the manga happens before they even meet Usopp. Oh yeah, that would be um go that would be the um um guy in the treasure chest, whatever his name chest, was. Yeah. Please tell me his name is actually Guy in the Treasure Chest. No, it's not. It's Goemon. I like my yeah. name better. Go I'm gonna call him Goemon, yeah. Right? I don't remember. But yeah. Oh, uh, that guy. Uh, that dude. Uh, the, the thing with him <clears throat> happens at different points in the story between the manga and anime. Yeah, but at, le but at least they still show both. Both of his appearances, because because they yeah. actually did put in the episode for um, Little Buggy's Big Adventures. Also, the events of the manga's first chapter are initially skipped over, but then later done as a flashback. Yes. Oh, so how my how my memory works? Here we go. Because oh, I don't do know it. why they did it like that? I think maybe they just wanted to get to showing what the actual tone would be like quicker? I don't know. Yeah, and they, and they also... Like, I distinctly remember one person who was reviewing the first episode of One Piece and hated Luffy because they thought he was invulnerable. And I do agree that the manga... that the <clears throat> anime did kind of do a dumb there. Because they showed Luffy, they showed like two dudes swinging swords at Luffy, and then the swords breaking. But the problem is though, Luffy is vulnerable to swords at that point in the game, at that point in the show. So it's just a dumb on the anime's part. Yeah, no, the the anime definitely made mistakes. Um, I'm trying to remember who voiced um Tail. Fingers, I think. Okay. So, who wants to voice um, Tail? Since Fingers is taking a break. Uh, hey, Brave, you want to do something today? You could do a cute little spherical voice, I bet. Sis? Tail! Swamp! Mountain! Ocean! Canyon, hurry! The four who are there, bring them here. And um, Kit, would you like to voice um, Skull Kid? Yeah. Don't speak out of line, stupid fairy. There's a bug buzzing around my, buzzing around my room. I don't know, don't know why. Kind of annoying me. That's it. I won't let you go. <laughs> let them go away as you expect them to. Oh well, whatever. Even if they were to come now, they wouldn't be able to handle me. <laughs> Just look above you. No, don't do it. Don't don't look above me. If it's something that can be stopped, then try to stop it. Death by schnoz. <laughs> To be honest, I'm gonna kill I wished, to be honest, I kind of wished that um, they gave you the oath to order last instead of first, because mm. it's kind of pointless if you try to use the oath of order before you have all four of the, before you defeated all four of the bosses. Yeah. Yeah, I think my favorite song favorite song is um, Elegy, of Empty Elegy of Emptiness, and then after that is um, Oath to Order. But it's mostly because Oath to Order sounds a lot like um, one of the, sounds like a stage song from Star Fox. Yeah. Oh. I 
Oh, Soul Kid has a headache too. Mm. If you've been making those those noises all day, I'd be worried. I'm real worried for you. You're giving me a headache. Freaking going full uh, Raider Repulsa there. Yeah, that was that was the point. Yes. <laughs> Gloriosa generosa, gloriosa generosa. I am a tired. Very giant <laughs> men. With oh, 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 oh. The giants are so strange. Yeah. Why do they look like that? Look, look, Dr. Robotnik's early creations, even though they looked like him, were a little, a little out of proportion, okay? <laughs> Get a load of this. I'd rather not. Look at them limbs jiggle. Eh. Um, I prefer to not. <laughs> so, um, are they, are they like... I'm gonna push the moon back up? Or what are they doing? Oh, what is they caught the moon. Fun. Why does the moon have a face? Uh, just because, this because this game is... Because this game is absolute nightmare fuel. Yes. This is the darkest game. Why does the moon have a face? <laughs> because Skull Kid wanted everyone to, to die and to do it in a very, very scared of everything. It, it stopped. We did it. It stopped. This. Tail. Good, we made it in time. The giant's call worked on the Skull Kid. Hey, Skull Kid, do you realize what you've been doing to everyone? Wait, sis, don't. Don't be so hard on the Skull Kid. Tail, why are you protecting him? Aren't you mad at him for hitting you so much? He was lonely, Skull Kid. He was trying to destroy everything around him. That is not the same as a lonely child. We can't Hate allow the that. Time. The power of the mask made him do it. There's too much for the Skull Kid to handle. It's because he doesn't know his place. On top of having a weak will and no strength of heart, he's a fool. Kit. S oh. Certainly. He had far too many weaknesses to use my power. Yeah, that's right. Admit your stupidity. Huh? Yeah. A puppet that can no longer be used is mere garbage. This puppet's rule has just ended. Brave. Brave. Oh, I can't be with that moon. I, I shall consume, consume everything. Don't say it, Roshan, don't you dare. <laughs> ah, this isn't good. Let's go back, let's go back. Hurry, song of time, song of time. Uh, my mom's calling me, I'll be right back. Ah, oh, no, you've gotta be kidding me. Don't tell me you're gonna go- you're going up there! I won't do it! 
You go by yourself. I'm staying with Tail. I'll go. What? What are you saying, Tail? Is something wrong with you? I don't always want to be running away. Well, I've been stronger. Skull Kid wouldn't have. I understand. I'll go. After all this time, Tail, you really, you've gotten really stubborn. Just like someone else I know. <laughs> you know, you guys are really stupid. I'm kidding! <laughs> Here we are, we're inside the moon! Interesting interior. Well, fine, when you can get your own moon, you can decorate how you like. Not very... Not very, uh, moon-like. I don't know, it's actually a really interesting old- one of the oldest sci-fi tropes to imagine the planets were, like, hollow and had whole interior worlds. Okay. Yes. And now... In this look in this world, um, you have options. You can either fight the- fight, um... Fight the final boss now, or talk to these other guys. Oh, by the way, all these guys' character models are little versions of the Happy Mask Salesman. Oh, interesting. Um, how about we each do these characters? They're I'm all sure. the same model anyway. Yeah, sure. I'll start. Ah, nice weather, isn't it? Masks, you have a lot. You too. Will you be a mask salesman? Then I'll play with you. So, the masks, give me some. Postman's hat. Thanks, you, you're a nice person, aren't you? Hide and seek, let's play. All right. I'll hide. Yaku Scrub. <laughs> this is gonna be the last time we're gonna be do this is gonna be the last time we're gonna be using Deku Scrub, so. Oh man. No more no more no more Deku Scrub racism jokes. Aww. It's okay, at the end of the day the kids of the town learned not to be racist. I mean, to plant specifically, they're still racist towards the Gorons and Zoras, but to plant specifically, they learn the lesson. Pizza heart! Oh, and yes, each four, each of these four sections has a piece of heart. No! Oh, shit. You died. You went and did a die. <sighs> ah, you kids these days. Ah, such such weak wills. I used oh to die three God. times before I even had lunch. I just saw. Uh... I'm looking in Rick's server and seeing all the things Lindlow was, and I'm like, oh my god. You got oh, one today that killed me too. <laughs> was it, uh, was it, was it, was it, was it, was it that one? I think from your, your oh, reaction fuck, comment yes. to it. Yes, that one's great, actually. 
I like that one very much. Wait a minute. What's, ha what's Haggis doing? What's Haggis doing? my room and irritating me. What's Haggis doing in an SFW channel? It's a setup. It's a trap. I'm being. I'm being led on. Part of a plot. What's he up to? Yeah. Yay! You made it. Goodbye, Deku Scrub. What do you mean it's not goodbye? I'm not gonna- I'm not gonna give up the Deku- I'm not gonna give up the Deku mask. Not no, yet. but we don't- no, we don't get to do tricks with it anymore. You found me. Hey. I want more masks. <laughs> Thanks, you're nice. Um, can I ask a question? Your friends... What kind of people are they? I wonder, do those people think of you as a friend? What, that's not how you take a walk in the park? <laughs> oh boy, I've been doing that wrong for years. Hi, goat. Ah, uh, nice weather, isn't it? Masks, you have a lot. You too. Will you be a mask salesman? Then I'll play with you. So the masks, give me some. Hi, would you like to wear a whole person's body on your face? Here you go. Well, I mean, when you pitch it like that. <laughs> More. How, Face is not what I guess. How about entrance into um, adult milk bars? Now we're talking. Thanks. You are. You are indeed a nice person. You're a nice person, aren't you? Hide and seek. Let's play. All right. I'll hide. Is there a point to this? Uh, the point is 100% um, in the game. But, uh. again, I don't have to... You don't have to talk to these kids. You could just go straight to the final boss. Mm -hmm. They really like taking your masks. Yeah, that's the point. The point... That's the point. The whole thing here is for you to... Um, the whole point on this is for you to just... Um, for you to surrender all the masks that you have. Mm. Kind of a gauntlet moment plus the uh, okay, like a completion a completionist moment. So it's kind of both. Yeah. Mm. So here's the thing about this particular location. These places are known as trials. This is supposed to be the trial of faith. So what I so what I'm going to do is curl. The penitent man, Indy. The penitent man. Roll forward. Then let go. I'm just holding down the button right now. Just gotta have faith that you'll get part. there, huh? Oh. Until that part.
So it kind of lures you into false sense of security and then fucks you over. Okay. That's called Nintendo, baby! I am very bad at these. Yeah, it's a. Yeah, the first part. It's the first part. But then you realize. Yeah, but it is also a lesson. Like, faith can only take you so far. Ooh. Interesting. Interesting metaphor. And it's not a good idea to trust in um, faith wholeheartedly. You have to accept reality, too. I like that. I believe you don't lose hearts really when you fall here. This. I can only assume the, the Goron rolling is very difficult to control. Yes. yes. Yeah, it is. Mm. Which is one of the reasons mm. why I have difficulties dealing with Goat. Mm. I was never great at it. Even in the remake, I still kind of struggle with these. They did make it easier in some regards, though. God, I'm so sleepy. Gyro controls are an interesting addition to some of these games. It was foretold by gyroscopic control, Mancy. <laughs> gyroscopic control, Mancy? Oh, no. <laughs> Aiden, Aiden will regret the day he inflicted that on me. <laughs> Trot your way for a minute. But yeah, when you have a con when you have con camera controls also, where it's not a fluid movement, but it has like little jerky positions, that makes a lot of these era of games have moments that are there we go. exceptionally challenging. Pizza heart. Piece of heart, but I think there is a location where I need to talk to. Yeah, you know, I I applied for a job at Nintendo back when this game was being made, but uh. I think I think my pitch to have the Goron throw up if he spins for too long was was what cost me the gig. <laughs> oh no. Hey, there's a new person in the uh, CA server. Uh, do you want to let, I think I'm gonna let you handle oh. it. The oh. Oh sure. Yeah. Here we are. Oh, How about a mummy? 
Actually, that is um, a daddy. <laughs> well, it was worn by a daddy. Oh, yeah. Not like that. <laughs> okay, for that, I'll offer you sad sadness in its purest form. <laughs> Thanks, you're... Nice, question mark? Uh, can I ask you a question? You, what makes you happy? I wonder, what makes you happy? Does it make others happy, too? Now let's go find George. There you are. Hey Brave, you up? One second. Sorry, trying to get thing done. Hmm. Uh Nice weather, isn't it? Yes. You have a lot. You, too. Will you be a mask salesman? I heard the line. Oh. Then I'll play with you. So, the masks. Give me some. Okay, how about the mask of an assassin? More. Oh, fine. How about the how you've had a you, here's the Assassin's Creed. Here's the God of War. More. Okay, here's Bomber Man. Okay, okay. This is the entire. This is the entire. Uh, Collection in <laughs> for uh, inside Akana. You're, you're a nice person, aren't you? Hide and seek. Let's play. Yep, you get to enjoy the bionicle mask. Here you go. <laughs> Boy. Be careful. All right. I'll hide. Be careful, I said the word Bionicle once and Brave's like, I have those, and spent like an hour digging them all out. Okay. This one is one of the worst. Because I'm going to create a suspend point here because stupid can happen here. You need the Zora mask. <laughs> and if you go in the wrong direction, if you end up succeeding, you will miss the piece of heart. And you can't go back. Mm -hmm. Lame. stone responds to the mask and speaks to you, but its words are heard in secret. It seems Guru Guru, the traveling musician, had the Bremen mask. 
So in the so these are here in case. These are all here in case you are missing masks and you're wondering if you're missing any. The thing is though is... And now I'm just gonna go ahead and say this. I have legit no, no idea where the actual directions are. I only looked up where to get the piece of art. Right. Ah. Left. Left. Right. Oh! I found it! Lucky me! You found me. Hey, I want more masks. Okay. How about a? How about the uh, face of a cursed child? More. Or yes, even, all the cursed children. Or even better, the face of fingers. Hmm. This is a mask that you can get married More. with. Hmm. More. Or a mask. Oliver, Oliver Twist asked for more. A mask to get blown by. <laughs> Thanks. You're nice. Um, can I ask a question? The right thing. What is it? I wonder... If you do the right thing... Does it really make... Everybody... Happy? Oh. Sorry, you took care of it. I was I, while I was che uh, checking the computer thing. Sorry about that. I was just about to. It was my thing to voice. It was what? It was my character to voice. No, 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 no. I meant the new. I meant the new. The new user. The new. The new. Oh, yeah. Sorry. I. Yeah, oh I no, 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 sorry. Of, yeah. It's on me. Okay, yeah, I'll voice this guy. Ah, nice weather, isn't it? Masks, you have a lot. You too. Will you be a mask salesman? Then I'll play with you. So, the masks, give me some. Okay, then you sound nice and high pitch. How about how would you like to be a frog conductor? <laughs> Ah, I see. I see the mask you like, uh, like er, like freaking worms and centipedes. How about uh, you uh, have this mask that'll help you dig in the dirt? Pick mask. More. And considering you like, and considering you like um, long things, how's about a team ninja fairy? Oh wow, you're insatiable, aren't you? Um How about creepy mask? Thanks. You're a nice person, aren't you? I didn't see. Let's play. All right. I'll hide.
Alright, I'm back. Alright. Are you guys still there? We are. Yeah, yeah we are. Alright, I had uh, a bit of a, a nervous breakdown when I was talking to my mom. Oh, jeez, I'm sorry. Are you alright? Just normal stuff that stresses me out. Gotcha. It wasn't sorry. like it wasn't like she just wanted. I just sort of was talking about things that were stressing me out, and sort of just. No, that's good. You have that's good though. That that's good though. You can open your mind about that. That probably helps, huh? Uh, I'm just... I, it's sort of the same way I've been to do it before, kid. So, I understand. Everybody I'm a mess needs, right everybody, now. Everybody needs... Everybody needs... Support sometimes, you know? I just want- I just want to do the bonus questions, who can't fuck the bonus questions? That should be your answer to the bonus questions. Fuck this. <laughs> I don't even have to do them to get a- to get a good grade in the class, I don't care. <sighs> just hate how unstable my brain's been since- No, 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 it's okay. Well, oh, no, damn it, you can. Yeah. Well, it's sort of similar things I've damned you before. Similar concerns, similar stresses. Just the same thing. It doesn't change the fact that it's still a thing. Okay. I've calmed down. Bundle of arrows. I need to start this assignment earlier next time I underestimated the sheer number of problems. <laughs> Sorry if I ruined the vibes with the screen. Oh no, you're good. I think everyone's just a little tired at that time. Right. Pretty sure Zero just ruined that guy's vibes for seeing. Yeah, <laughs> but remember those those particular models for Ten Bomb Shoe. And now I'm going to do another thing. I am doing this. Because there is an explosive thing up there. I have to hit that with the bomb chew. Oh boy. And if I miss my ten sh if I miss those ten shots, then if I miss those ten shots, then I'm soft locked. Oh jeez. Good oh, game design right there. Yeah, a little bit questionable, but... Yeah, the only- yeah, if you run out of bomb juice, you have to go backwards and you can't complete the thing. <clears throat> okay, I was think I was thinking it would go all the way around, but...
Yay, I got it. They give you ten shots, but the fact that it's a thing at all is kind of dumb in my opinion. Yeah. I would agree. Then again, I'm kind of, I'm the kind of person who would who would actually make a game called Oops All Soft Locks. Oh no. Would you would you know? I totally would just to see how people would react. Mean. <laughs> and with that, I've 100 percented the game. Woo! Yeah, on that note. Look, Grizz gets it from somewhere. Mm -hmm. The uh irresistible impulse to to troll people and stuff you make. Oh right, there's another one here too. Oh, the timing on those is such a pain. Dang, second try. Very nice. Okay, here's a foxy mask. Oh yeah. Mark. A mask that drove Kit insane. No, you monster! Mark. A mask that makes people invisible. You've given him the power to make the chickens dance. What have you done? Question. Your true face. What kind of face is it? <laughs> I wonder. The face under the mask. Is that your true face? Ask Roshan. Roshan's the expert on that one. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Totally isn't creepy at all. Jiminy Criminy Christmas, 7%. I'm going for hours now. What are you doing? Uh, I'm, tr I'm trying to... I'm trying to back some stuff up and partition a, a hard drive. And uh, I don't know why okay. it's so agonizingly slow today. I mean, I know I'm backing up some hefty stuff, but I don't remember it ever being quite this... Okay. Slow. Kit? It's all you. Everyone has gone away, haven't they? Will you play with me? Yeah. You don't have any masks left, do you? Well, let's do something else. How cheesy. Let's play good guys against bad guys. Yes, let's play that. There's the Fierce Deity Mask. Could this mask dark powers be as bad as Majora? Try it on, Wizzy. We'll Are you ready? You're the bad guy. And when you're bad, you just run. That's fine, right? Well... Shall we play?
Yeah, now the four remains are separated. <laughs> Here we are. Majora's Mask. <clears throat> oh my god, it's been a jellyfish this whole time. <laughs> Oh dear. Hey, there he is. Dang, you just Final Fantasy Blade beam his ass. Forgot how good that is. Too. What the fuck? That's disturbing. Majora's incarnation. Not, if you're not dancing, are you even Eldritch Horror incorrectly? It's real weird. Majora's Wrath. Gooey. Oh, gooey? Sound effects. At least if you know the kinds of things that the the ancient tribes dark gods were into. Either jump rope or something a lot easier. I kept having a hardest time getting near this dude last time I played. Like for whatever reason I could not dodge for the life of me. Weird, because it's usually not quite that bad. Yes, Majora does have a play. Oh my god, it really is a 2000s game. <laughs> Didn't mean to do that. Some people take letter rip very, very seriously. Oh, dear. <laughs> I never did collect the bay, all the bay, all the eyeball bay blades. Though. That's, that's a regret. The exploding eyeball bay blades. Yeah. <laughs> And that's game. Very nice. Yeah, I didn't want to use... I didn't want to use, um... 
the fierce deity mask throughout the entire fight. I wanted to at least show the last bit of it off. I can understand that. Because if you use fierce deity mask, you just win. And <laughs> yeah. I didn't want to use it throughout the entire fight. I wanted to do something with it. Oh no, the moon's gonna hurl. I don't feel so good, you guys. Thus, the day was saved, thanks to Gay Pride once again. Mm. Oh yeah, and Giants and <coughs> Link or something. And with this, all the proper timelines that you've created merge together to, into a dawn of a new day. Ah! He's awake! Guys, you hadn't gotten about me? You, you still thought of me as a friend? Save me? I thought they didn't want to be friends with me. But they hadn't forgotten about me. <laughs> friends are a nice thing to have. <laughs> Could you be my friend too? I have the same smell as the fairy kid who taught me that song in the woods. I, I, I know, I know. Let's do something. Yeah, unfortunately, um, Fingers is not here, so I'll go ahead and voice him. <laughs> so, Eva's left the mask after all. Well now, I finally have it back. Well, since I'm in the midst of my travels, I must bid you farewell. Shouldn't you be returning home as well? Whenever there's a meeting, a parting is sure to follow. However, that parting need not last forever. Whether our parting be forever or merely a short time, that is up to you. With that, please excuse me. Jump cuts really do unnerve you, huh? Yeah. <laughs> but you sure have managed to make quite the number of people happy. The masks you have are filled with happiness. 
This is truly a good happiness. Ooh. <laughs> and then he just vanishes. And he just, just beam me up. I must go now. My planet needs me. <laughs> Happy mass salesman died on his way back to his planet. <laughs> well, both of us have gotten what we were after. So this is where you and I part ways, isn't it? You know, it was kind of fun. Well, it's almost time for the carnival to begin. Why don't you just leave? Why don't you just leave and go about your business? The rest of us have a carnival to go to. Yep, time for mode. Time for me to leave and become a Stalfos. Bye. No oh boy. Silo. Thank you. Because unfortunately, according to the timeline, that's what happens. Yeah, we, yeah, dude. The actual, yeah. the actual, uh, trying to like untangle the actual timeline of this is just nuts. Like, I, I don't know the, even like the closest thing to an official timeline is, is a little. <laughs> A little wild. Yep. And with that, this is the end of this is the end of Majora's Mask. Woo. Yeah. <laughs> the uh, the the nightmare, the surreal nightmare, beautiful, horrible. Nightmare of Termina is conquered. And this Such a unique be, game. Yeah, I was originally intending for this to be an all-mask run, but with everything that I got, I might as well just go ahead and say, uh, screw it, might as well just go at 100%. Hmm. But yeah, that will do it. What game am I gonna play? What game am I gonna play next? I don't know. I'll have to think of something. The Legend of Zelda: uh, Wilfred's Mask. Ah, uh, you get to see these two boneheads. Draw your sword with a what? Yeah, that, those two might as well have been freaking the um, Zelda Dimensions version of um, freaking Sansa Papyrus. Yes. Papyrus. Sans, stop plaguing my life with incidental music. <laughs> By the way, um, I was wondering if either of you had um, heard the version of... Of... Um, I don't know. If, I don't know if you've gotten this far in um, Has Been Hotel yet, but um, there's a song called "Loser Baby." Oh, that's the best song. Yeah, someone made a um, someone made a parody of it with um, Sans and um, Papyrus. Oh my God! Yes. <laughs> oh look, it's the weird pointy naked chorus line. The Team Ninja Fairies have. <laughs> They must go now. Their planet needs them, too. They're yeah. immortal, so they can't die on the way. And now she's Robin Hood, effectively. They come back, and she's just got the Doom Slayer shotgun. Not this time. <laughs> yeah, the freaking zombies. Or the the freaking aliens. Heck, they might be alien zombies at this point, considering how many times they come back. Yep, now he's surrounded by chickens. I have my army and I will conquer the world. And that's why and that's what we learned today was that the Bellman mask is actually the most powerful mask. 
you can do the whole thing for Batman Returns, where all the all the birds strapped with bombs run at run. Oh yeah, the, pe- do your the penguins. Yeah. <laughs> Yay, let's all get drunk. We're saved. The giant saved us. Woo! Get drunk on that nice, nice milk. I do. And on that on that day we celebrate by getting utterly tanked uh, and talking about those giants coming and catching the moon and then the moon doing shots something like that. Look, don't judge my culture. Wait, Tingle, no, your planet doesn't need you too. We need you. You're too... You're too important. That's, uh... Yeah, they cover it up because they don't actually have a character model for, um... Older Cafe. Hmm. Oh, and look. Oh. Yeah, that is basically confirmation that that's, that tree there is um, the butler's son. Game is so heavy. Darkest game! Darkest game! Darkest game! Darkest game! In Ocarina, they end with like a big dance party and Mario and Luigi getting drunk, and in this one, it's just Ichabod Crane. And now... Link continues his search for continues his search for Navi, which unfortunately does not end well. I'd be fascinated if Nintendo actually decided to make a direct Majora's follow-up, timeline-wise. Yeah. Aww. By the way, um. Oh wow! It's um. We're 22 minutes over, but we needed to finish mm-hmm. the game, so. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Never accuse me of not being a little extra. Mm-hmm. The end. Now, let me go ahead and tell you all a quick little story. Um, in the manga, they actually show how the how Majora's Mask was created. Ooh. So you see, there was this dragon that exist that existed um, somewhere in the world, and a warrior walked up, and a warrior walked up to him and said, "Actually, actually, hold on a second. Give me a quick second. I'll actually find that um, manga right now. Give me like a quick second. I make this fast. I want to go to bed. Bedtime story for Brave." I didn't hear that shit cut out. Oh, sorry. I said it's a bedtime story for you. Good, good, good. Okay, believe it or not, I know this is a thing that, like, adults do for children, but, like, this is a thing adults should do for other adults. Being read to sleep actually um, is really mm-hmm. soothing. The The human voice, there's something about a familiar human voice, the cadence, that um, activates a part of your, like, social nervous system and makes you feel comfortable. So, like, your nerves... Mm-hmm. Your reactive nervous system kind of chills. Yee. Okay, yeah, so... Yeah, so there's a um, creature that... Yeah, this story is an original... The story here is an original story from the... Um, from the Arthur. It's not... Arthur? Te- from um, the author, um, Akira Himikawa. Oh. Who... Um, who did basically all the Legend of Zelda manga, including the most recent Twilight Princess. Um, so, so, so the story of Major of the original, like how the mask was created, was that a creature lived, there was a creature that um, lived alone in the deserted part of the world. Eventually, a human, eventually a human appears, and, um, ask, and, takes a rest on the takes a rest next to the dr- 
next to the um, creature. And then, and then the creature basically assumes that the human came to steal his armor because if because the armor um, anyone who steals his armor gets their wish granted. Huh. Interesting. But then, but um, any human that. Um, any human that did arrive to try to take his armor, the creature devoured them. Mm. Cool. Then, <laughs> as creatures are wont to, that that made Roshan pay attention. <laughs> but um, the creature, but then the creature um, asked the asked the um, traveler what he wanted, <laughs> and but the creature then but then the human basically asked them. I wonder. It's like how long have you been living here alone? Ignored by like uh, being stuck in a frozen time. And basically says, but the monster then realizes that he can't actually leave the place he was stuck in. Hmm. So, so he was yeah he's basically bound there for thousands of years. Yeah, the sort of like a Puss in Boots type of t- trick. Yeah. But the creature says like, um... <clears throat> so then the creature... But then the human decides to pull out a drum and starts, um... Starts playing a song for him and then the monster starts to dance. He and the monster start to dance. And, um, time begins to move forward. Oh, it's funny, when, usually when I go dancing with somebody, time stops. Yep. And then when... The, and then um, they dance for three days and three nights. And then... Um, and then the monster... Um, and then the monster... Um, yeah, then the monster and the world that surrounded him um, perished. Hmm. Yeah, but it turned out like the monster wanted the to- the monster used his power to um, make time move forward, causing him to collapse. At which point, all that's left was the armor. I see, because everything else was just. Then at that then at that point, um, the then the human took a piece of the armor, and then carved it into a mask, and then. And then threw it into the void. That was Majora's mask. Interesting. And that's I, the yeah. I'm sorry. And that's basically the idea of like uh, the spirit of Majora, spirit of Majora, the spirit of this creature was inside that mask. What like seeking, like um, being alone, but. Um, like that didn't want to be alone, but devoured anybody who would come near, because anybody who would come near him threatened him. Very strong metaphor but for yeah. like uh, letting people in, like letting your guard down, letting people in, wanting to be connect, but also being afraid of connecting. It's a cool metaphor. Yep. So while I think of another game to play. For, to um, balance out between this and Mega Man Battle Network. Mega Man Battle Network will be coming up this Wednesday. So, mm-hmm. thank you. But until, we find, until I can think of another game to play, thank you all for joining us, and we'll see you all next time. I'll get ready to raid. I'll get ready to raid the Rue Crew, and I'll see you all next time. <laughs> Darn it, why am I getting hiccups now? <laughs> Stupid outro hiccups. Stupid. Yep. Thank you all for joining us, and we'll see you all next time. Bye bye. Goodbye. Goodbye. Brave, so tired. Uh-